Let's make an AI deep fake video. Head over to swapface.org and I'm gonna download for Windows. It's gonna download this version of swapface.exe and I'll hit download. The file is 2.76 gigs, so it might take a bit. While we're waiting, this is the pricing. So on the free plan, you get 10 video face swaps per day, but it does come with a watermark. Don't worry, we're gonna remove the watermark later in this video. All right, the download's done. I'm gonna open up the file. It wants me to create a D folder called swap face, but I'm just gonna browse and put it in my business folder. After it has installed, it's gonna launch this app and we need to sign into an account. I don't have one yet, so I'm gonna click sign up and I'm gonna enter all of this stuff in. So your dashboard consists of a few features. You have stream face swap, video face swap, image face swap, and then some app details. So we want the video face swap and there's two steps. The first step is we need the video and the second step is we need a face. For the video, I'm gonna use a free stock website called Pexels and I'm gonna click this and change to videos and I'm gonna search a woman laughing and quickly looking through all these, I like this one. It's a short seven second video. A quick word of note, you wanna swap the face on a video where the model kind of looks like the person that you're gonna do the face swap with. I'm gonna use my AI influencer, Nora Lewis. She's a brunette, similar build. So this video is perfect. I'm gonna click free download. Back in swap face, I'm gonna upload that video. Once the video has loaded, it's gonna recognize the face in the video. If there are multiple people in the video, you'll get to choose which face you want to replace. Because there is only one face in this video, it's only showing me one option. I'm gonna click this and select choose. Now we have to find the model. And I'm gonna find my AI model, Nora Lewis, from my Discord server. Let's right click, save image. Then I'm going to upload that image into swap face. It's going to auto crop her face from the image. I'm gonna select it. Now in the bottom, we have a few settings. I'm gonna click this drop down box. We got fast mode, pro mode, expert mode, and hybrid mode. Fast mode has the fastest processing speed with lower resource consumption. If you have a bad computer, no graphics card, low CPU, you should choose fast mode. Pro mode gives you better quality, but it's longer processing time. And expert mode has the best swap performance with higher resource consumption. Now I couldn't find any documentation on the hybrid mode, but I'm assuming it's a mix or a blend between all those modes. For this experiment, I'm gonna just choose the fast mode and click start. Let's continue with a watermark. I have a basic Dell laptop. It's the Inspiron 15 3000 series, and the fast mode is giving me just around five minutes of processing time, which if you know anything about AI deepfake videos, that's actually fantastic. This stuff takes a long time because it's changing the face in every single frame. So obviously, the longer the video, the longer this is going to take. When it's all done, you're gonna get this message. It's gonna tell you to open the folder. I'm gonna click open and it sends you right over here. Let's double click, see the result. And this is our AI influencer has been face swapped onto this video, pretty cool. Now with all deep fakes, I notice a little glitching on the face. I can see it in the nose here, but from a far away distance, I think it's pretty good. For comparison, this is the original video and this is the face swapped one. To make it a little more obvious of what's going on, I'm gonna choose a model of Asian descent. Let's choose this one and let's start the video processing. Still under six minutes. The processing is complete. I'm gonna click this to open the folder. And this is the result. We can definitely see she has changed her ethnicity. This is what we got on the fast mode, so imagine what's possible on the pro mode. My laptop was not able to use the pro mode. It didn't have enough GPUs. If you have a more souped up computer, give it a shot. To remove the watermark on our deep fake video so we can just use the free version, I'm gonna use this tool vmake.ai. So let's upload the video. And after processing, this is the result. We have the original and you can see the swapface.org watermark at the bottom. And this is the version with the watermark removed. I'm gonna click download full HD video. 
it's telling me that it costs two credits to download. You get five credits on your free trial. And here it is. Awesome. An AI deep fake video with no watermark. If you get this error message when trying to upload your video, go over to the free cloudconvert.com, open your file, and then click convert MP4 to MP4. Then click convert. There may be a glitch with swap faces MP4 output and vmake.ai's app. There are many AI deepfake video tools, so let me know in the comments below if you want me to review some of them. The full online course, how to build a custom AI app. Start your own AI side hustle today. Click the link in the description below. And if you like this video, there's two more on the screen right now. Choose which one interests you the most, click it, watch it, I'll see you there, peace.